Hey guys, I hope you're all doing really well. So today I'm going to be doing a dress haul. I picked out quite a few dresses that I really like and I thought you guys would like to see them too, seeing as the weather is now getting a bit nicer and we're getting these really random heat waves. So these dresses are from three different places. There's one from Urban Outfitters, Topshop and ASOS. So all pretty affordable dresses in this video. So as always, they will be linked down below if you're interested and I'm just gonna get started. So this first one is from Urban Outfitters. This is the only one I have from Urban Outfitters in this haul and it's this really gorgeous satin floral slip style dress. I think it's maxi length or very long midi length. Um, and then it ties at the back like this and the front has little gallard details under the bust and it's just such a gorgeous dress. I was really worried about the color to start with because it's pretty nude but it actually looks really good on pale skin and goes nicely with red hair as well. So hopefully they still do this. It was in the sale when I bought it um, but I'm sure it's probably still in the sale. I usually steer away from these sorts of dresses because my body seems to hold a lot of static energy so some synthetic dresses just like stick to my body um, but this one doesn't so very happy about that and then if it's a bit cooler I can wear like a long sleeve top underneath or a t-shirt so I love this style of dress I'm so glad I finally got one in my wardrobe that I know I love and I'm gonna wear a lot and then Topshop were doing 40% off so I went a little bit mad with the Topshop dresses they actually had some really really lovely ones on there first one I actually picked up from ASOS first in a size 8 and realised it was too small for me. Sometimes I really struggle with size 8 Topshop dresses because they can be really tight on my chest and with my anxiety I just can't have anything tight on my chest. This one is a size 10 and I have tried it on and it is quite a lot bigger but it's also just a much nicer fit on me. The chest is maybe a little bit too baggy um, but I can try and fix that maybe we'll see and also on the size 8 the cuff was just so tight to get over your hand um, and then the size 10 just glides straight over so I don't know what's going on with their size 8 but I love this dress so much I love the green seersuckery black check fabric I just think it's so cool this looks really good with my hair up in like a really slick bun so if you want this dress and they don't have it in stock in Topshop then maybe try ASOS they might have it back in stock by now. The next Topshop dress is again like a satin style fabric and it is in the most beautiful construction. I love when dresses have like a v-neck with gathered bits at the side into like this really pretty style dress. really love this. The only thing that annoys me a little bit about this dress and I know it's to save fabric and cost um, is that the front is gathered but the back is not gathered and it's just the same sort of hemline it just to me is a bit odd to gather the front and not the back of a dress um, but yeah it's just such a gorgeous sort of tea dress vintage style the back is actually gathered at the top of the back along here which is really beautiful I also bought this one in a size 10 because I was just I didn't want to have the tight chest problem again with the size 8 um, and it fits really nicely, it just doesn't even feel like you're really wearing anything when you wear this dress. So yeah, really love this dress. Just not sure about the print colours, like they're just a bit washed out maybe for me, but I'm going to try it on again and decide. I then picked up exactly the same dress but in a different colourway, so this one is in like a really deep cherry floral pattern which is really pretty but the problem with this print is it kind of hides all the really beautiful construction detailing in the dress very flattering and they were like 40% off originally 45.99 I think they were like 20 something pounds each so pretty amazing price for a dress like this okay this next dress from Topshop I'm still really undecided as to whether I'm going to keep it or not this one was a bit more expensive it was originally 100 pounds but it was in the sale for like 60 or 70 pounds I think um, but it's this gorgeous beaded dress with like an asymmetric hem at the bottom and it's just so stunning it's really heavy because it's got lots of beading all over it I love a cowl neckline on a dress like this um, but you really wouldn't be able to wear a bra with it because the back is completely open 
Although you could wear like a pretty lacy bra. It's just so gorgeous. Like even the slip underneath has a little bit of embroidery on it. Then the final dress from Topshop is this really simple black um, star print mini dress. It's got a little bit of piping detail across the front and then it's got this open like keyhole at the front. It doesn't look like much on the hanger but when you put it on it's super flattering and the sleeves sort of puff up slightly which just gives such a nice simple silhouette. I feel like this dress is very Alexa Chung. So yeah I'll show you guys what this looks like on. This will be a great dress for autumn and winter as well with tights and like a big black jacket. And then the final dress is from ASOS and I wore this the other day um, hence why some of the buttons are still undone. This is such a sweet little cotton summer dress. It comes with a, like a muslin slip underneath which gives no coverage whatsoever. So you still have to wear a bra with this, which is a shame. But it's just the softest fabric and it gives a really sweet sort of boho look. This one was selling out really fast and I don't know if they actually have any more in stock, but hopefully they do by the time this video goes out if you're interested in that dress. So there we go, those are all of the new dresses I have picked up recently. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you found any nice summer dresses recently and where you found them from. So yeah, I hope you guys are all having a great day and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!